Hey guys, I wanted to pop on here and have a quick, serious conversation with y'all. So you guys know that I've had my second channel. I've been messing with it for almost a year now. And I've been trying to figure out what to do, where to go with that channel. Wasn't quite sure. Well, I've, my, my ideas and my thoughts have been solidified. I know what I'm going to do. I know what I have to do. And I want to tell you guys about it. So long story short, um, a few months back, Aaron and I innocently at first let our political views be, be known. Now we lost lots of people and they have every right to leave because you know, it's still a free country. And I totally get that. But the problem is, is that media and YouTube, along with all the other platforms are very biased and they have a degree with only one opinion and one side. Though I've been very um, respectful with my ideas and my opinions and the things that I think and how I answer people, it didn't matter. They only have one side. And I'm all for free speech. Uh, free, free speech should be protected and free speech to me is protecting the person's speech that doesn't align with yours, the one that doesn't go along with the agenda. That's the one that needs to be protected. And it isn't today. So my channel has had this big black cloud, this shadow ban per se, put over it. And I know there's gonna be a lot of people that watch or snicker or whoever gives this video a thumbs down because they love to do that too. That'll be like, that's what you get. No, what I get is you you left and you had every right to leave. You know, I can't I can't stop you. It's your right to not watch things that don't bring you joy or bring you happiness or whatever. And if seeing my husband's t-shirt and that rubs you the wrong way makes you want to leave, then that's your prerogative. Um, but they have they have shadow banned my channel and it's it's quickly sinking. It's quickly sinking, my my channel, this channel on chapter two. So I guess my request to you, any of you out there that can still even see this video, <laughs> is that if you'll go over to our second channel, House on Noble, and if you guys believe in free speech, and if you guys believe in like, just the American dream, just, you know, living your life, being with your children, just all those things, all those things like, that just are us to our core, that make our home, that make our business, that make us who we are, that some of you guys actually like to watch. If you guys would go over to House on Noble and make sure you guys subscribe over there because I'm going to slowly shut this channel down. After 13 or so years, it's just, it's failing and I have to start something new. I've tried, Lord knows I've tried. No one can say that I haven't, that I haven't tried, but, um, I have to, I have to look forward. And I have to try something new. So if you guys believe in any of that, if you believe in me, if you believe in Aaron, I would greatly appreciate it if you guys could go over there and subscribe, like the videos, comment, share them on the different platforms. And we'll, we'll try and grow and learn and do some other things over on our other channel. I really appreciate all of you. Um, again, the, the cha this channel is going to slowly start to close. So if you guys could. Um, head on over there. It's been some kind, it's been a run on this channel. So <sighs> anyways, thank you guys so much. And um, yeah, I'll talk to you over there. Bye. Oh, I can't see. Hey everyone. Hey, we're at the, I about to say family dollar. No family dollar. <laughs> we're at uh, Salvation Army. We're going to go in here and see if we can find anything that we can use in our house that we can um, upcycle and make some DIYs with or something like that. So let's go shop it. This looks like one of those cow parade cows. Oh, and the ear's broken. Never mind. That's not good. Nope. These are the spinny shelves. Little baby. Naked baby. 
Nothing on that one. Oh, that's cute. Robert Cord in Australia. Hmm, I might look him up. Oh, here's a couple. There's a snail. Oh, from Big Lots. And a dolphin. We have owls. Broken ear. This is a store I found some sterling silver candle holders that did well on eBay. Trick or treat. Mm, here's a little oil lamp. Hmm. Other than that, I've not found anything yet. These are always pretty. Four ninety nine. These cute little metal Santa mugs. I'm gonna take a picture of them. Those other ice cream cups weren't doing nothing, so well, that's pretty. Oh, it's acrylic. Nicole Miller. Anyways, I'm gonna take a picture of these. Hey, scratch that, I'm leaving. So come with me next door to the community thrift and we'll see what they got over there. Community thrift. Try this again. Let's try it out. America. Let's try it. <laughs> oh, look at this Lillian. She's a pretty lady, $20. She's got a whole makeup on her face and everything. Cool. That's kind of cool too. That yellow one. I don't even do yellow. They got different shelving instead of racks. Oh, this is the new cart. Someone took those out. Excuse me. $14.95. Yeah. Okay. We were joking about this the other day. Like we pick up, um, well here they're cheap, but like Goodwill, their mugs are like $4.99 and you can go get them brand new at TJ Maxx for $4.99. That's pretty. $7.95. It was $12.99. That's broken, but that was cute too. Ooh, we have. Hobby Lobby beads, $3.95. Oh look, a, a light kit, oh it's six ninety five. dollars never mind. The light kit's probably cheaper. Yeah, I think it is. Hmm. Is this a, nope, I can feel it. I know. Yeah. $14.95? What think... happened to this store? Same thing that happened to the other one there. Well, oh, I'm candy bag. Huh? I don't know any kids down my street or anything like that. I looked at that one already. I have this here. Look, it's another left in cream and sugar. Didn't we just had one similar? I don't know if it's the exact flower pattern, but the pillow shift thing right here. Oh, well, that would happen putting them in a bag like Got that. What is this little the eagle and a fish? Oh, that's that diamond dot painting. What? Stuff, materials, supplies. Oh, for planners. Some little target trees. I need to find some um envelopes for Bianca. For her to mail her stuff out. Oh, here's some. Oh no, they're knife rests, but they're not glass. Oh. What do we have here? Oh, nativity with a broken head. Okay. I get it. I get it. I get it. Okay. 
I have some Dollar Tree glue. Ooh, that wasn't good to begin with. Ain't gonna be good now. So they don't have all their aisles up because they're redoing them, I guess. So this is gonna be it for the for the stuff. Yeah, party our best for the bottle. Oh, and 50% off green, yellow, and 30% off pink. Left and left in kitty cut. That's like the coolest thing in this store. <laughs> Blue's not on sale. Got some figurines over here. Oh, she's pretty. Dollar ninety-five. See, it's all empty because they're putting new shelves up. Well, I guess that's gonna be it for me here too. So, nope. I guess I'm gonna call it a day. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching this crazy video. <laughs> Today. Nope. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you subscribe to House on Noble because uh, that's where I'll be posting majority of my content from here on out. And I'll talk to you guys in another one. Say bye. Bye, everybody.